The Smart Stadium project is a project involving DCU, Intel and Crow Park and some colleagues from the US Arizona State University where we're working on, on the concept of Crow Park as a testbed for Internet of Things technologies. Uh, it involves deploying sensors and gateways to capture data, analyze that data and derive some uh, intelligence from that. Each of the sensors communicates with the gateways and the gateways uh, send that information, send that data through to uh, some cloud storage where it's analyzed and some KPIs and further analysis is, is conducted there. What is the data you're trying to garner here and why would it be important to the GAA or, or the Crowdfire? Uh, well, there's, there's kind of two strands to that answer, really. Uh, in the first instance, as a proof of concept, as a test bed, um, the project is trying to validate the, uh, the technology, trying to generate some use cases which work in Crow Park, but also are um, valid for smart cities. So the technologies that are de being deployed here um, are intended for use in smart Dublin and in other, in other areas. Uh, from, from Crow Park's perspective, there are a number of reasons why we're trying to do this. Uh, first and foremost would be sustainability. So one of the biggest um, overheads that Crow Park has is around its energy consumption. And uh, a big driver of that is the artificial lighting that we put on the pitch. So one of the projects that we're uh, working on is to, to measure the shade on the pitch so that we can more accurately and, and in, a, in a smarter manner direct where we need the lighting and for how long. Every minute of time saved with the lights off uh, is a direct cost saving for Crow Park. So there is a, a cost saving and sustainability aspect to it and that's one of the primary reasons why we're, why we're involved. So Croke Park gives us a test bed to take our work out of the lab and into a much more realistic environment. One of the guys uh, is doing particular interest in crowd analysis, so looking at how people move around the stadium. So we've been looking at how to best use existing infrastructure like CCTV cameras for that, but also uh, the light on the pitch is using a pitch camera that we've installed in conjunction with Croke Park. And the data that's coming from that, we're using to feed into that to see what sort of activities are happening, where is the light and shade, how are people responding to different actions on the pitch. So there's a, there's a transatlantic partnership group between ASU and DCU. It's slightly odd, ASU is one of the largest publicly funded universities in America, um, but the presidents have a shared ethos around education. So we have this, this partnership along a number of different projects, so Smart Stadium is just one example. The usefulness for us and their interest is that they actually have their own stadium on campus. So they are in the process of renovating that. So a number of the projects, for example, some of the, the crowd excitement monitoring work uh, is being replicated over there in the Sun Devil Stadium and they also have researchers who are working collaboratively with us on developing that technology. But the light and shade is a really good example. So here in Croke Park, we're concerned about making sure that the grass has sufficient light to grow. So we want to maximise the, the light exposure. Of course, in Sun Devils, in Arizona, it gets slightly warmer than it does here in Dublin. And so they're interested in perhaps where is the shade falling because that's potentially the most comfortable place for people to be watching the match from. 